Okay, time for a video blog. Uh, <clears throat> I've got like so many songs I need to put on MySpace, but MySpace be a uh, jerk sometimes at night time, and I cannot put stuff on. Uh, I Let's see, I got a lot to say, so I'm going to say it kind of quick, kind of. Uh, first off, first and foremost, uh, I know I've been putting bulletins and blogs and notes and texting people, and I think I even emailed. But if you've received any sort of an email, not on MySpace or YouTube or Facebook, but a regular email from my Jeffrey C. Jordan at SPCGlobal.net, and it had any kind of perverse or nude pictures in it, I did not send those. I didn't take those. I didn't send those. I had nothing to do with those. Somebody else is doing that. My email was hacked. Uh, and so, yeah, that really sucks. So, yeah. So, you know. Let's see. The other night, I uh, worked. Friday night sucked, okay, because I worked. It snowed so bad, it was ridiculous. I mean, it was just horrible. I mean, everywhere got it. I, didn't, I think Indiana, at least my part of Indiana, got it the least. I mean, there were states that were almost like closing down. It was so bad. Like Ohio and all that kind of stuff. And Tennessee and Kentucky and stuff, I think. But, yeah, mine wasn't, was not nowhere near as bad. So... <clears throat> But, um, yeah, so, no, none of that. Uh, I don't know what I was saying, but someone texted me. But, uh, yeah, so, yeah. Uh, yeah. All I know is I fell, like, three times at night. Not once, not twice, but three times. And the third time, man, I fell off of about a four-foot ledge. As I was going up somebody's back door to their porch, and it was kind of up a hill. And I slipped, and I just, bam, flat on my back, man. And let me tell you what, that crap hurts, man. That crap hurts. Uh, it, nonsense. Uh, and if you're curious about what awesome song I'm listening to in the background, that is Trent William on Again Tonight. Check it out. Um, yeah, it's funny. I had a few people email me on MySpace telling me how Man, there's no way James Otto and Rascal Flats, uh, Jada Marcus called you. I'm like, whatever, I don't care if you believe me or not. They did, I know. That's all that matters. So, something in my tooth. I was eating strawberries and something, oh, whatever. I feel weird now, I feel like something's in there. I'm, uh, digging in my mouth with my tongue and stuff. Yeah, I don't want to do that on there, it looks nasty. But, uh, let's see what else. Uh, I was watching Big Brother last night, and I saw what I think is one of the most funniest things in the entire world. Uh, Natalie, who is the the bikini barista from, like, Oregon or some crap. I don't know where, but I just know she's a bikini barista. And she's really a sweet girl. I mean, she's into God and all that. She's very sweet. And she's one of the people that's just going to get walked on probably most of her life because she is... She just... I don't know. She's just too nice. And it's probably going to hurt her. And, and that sucks, but that's why it works. But she made one of the funniest comments I've, I've ever heard. She was talking about numbers, doing something, and she goes, yeah, there's 27 blocks, and there's 27 letters in the alphabet. And Ryan, and I think Adam or somebody was there, and they're like, no, there's 26. She goes, no, there's 27. And this is exactly what she does. I kid you not. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, 10, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, 20, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. She counted and as a letter. And they're like, sweetie, and is not a letter. And she goes, oh, oh, so stupid. It was just hilarious. You had to be there. You had to see it. I wasn't there, but I watched it. So it was like being there. Uh, yeah. 
pretty, pretty funny. Okay, pretty funny. And I, I don't like Joshua because I just think he's an evil person. As I'm doing him being gay, I just think he's an evil person. Evil, evil person. I really do. I just really, really do. And now they're talking about you. Uh, they might be. They're going to be voting one of the old players that have been kicked out back in. Yeah, I'm kind of torn. I'd like to see Parker come back in because I thought Parker was funny and Parker was kind of low key and calm. Okay, I'd like to see Jen come back in just because Jen is super hot. I'd like to see uh, 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 Alex come back in just because I thought he. I think he deserves it. I think Alex is one heck of a guy. I mean, I think he's a really genuinely nice guy, uh, down to earth, and just gets along with everybody. So I think of everyone, he's really my favorite choice. And the only reason I'd want to see Allison come back in is just to ruin Joshua's day. Just to ruin his day. So other than that, you know, I don't care. You know, I think Jacob got a raw deal, but, you know, he's done miss too much of the show. and I just don't think it's fair. Okay, almost the same with Jen, really. She's been gone too long. The ones that just got kicked out, you know, whatever. I don't know. But, I don't know. It's kind of cool that they're not partners no more. That's pretty cool. What else? Can we get this? Uh, the other night, uh, I went to eat with my parents and my brother, Jamie, at Smoky Bones, down south here of Indianapolis. And I ran into the girl that sings in the band. Uh, Sarah Nichols, excuse me, and her uh, fiance, Corey, awesome people. Okay, I, if I had a perfect definition of the perfect Christian girl or person, actually, not just girl, perfect Christian person, it would totally be Sarah Nichols. I just, I think she's like perfect, you know, not like perfect looking, I mean, she's cute, but the way she is, her personality, the way she treats people, I think she's perfect. I mean, she is a perfect example of what people should strive to be with God or something. Okay? Perfect in that way, I think. I'm sure she's got her problems. Everyone does, but that's what I think. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Debbie Gibson. Debbie Gibson. Anyway. Uh, but then I ended up going home that night, and I felt like crap, okay? I didn't go watch the band play because I felt horrible. Because I think I had some internal bleeding. I mean, I was going to the bathroom, there was blood. I was throwing up and there was blood. And I just sat there and did nothing. And I ended up having like a three or four hour conversation over MySpace and texting and stuff with a, a young girl named Sarah Anderson from Ohio. Very lovely young lady. She's really fun to talk to. She's just got a great personality. and has I, I love her pictures. She just has so much fun. It seems like no matter what she does. I mean, even at work. Who has that much fun at work? Sarah Anderson. That's who. So, yeah. That was cool. So, I really enjoyed that. I have like 50 billion comments on my MySpace where we were just... We was using the bulletins like... Uh, or not bullet, we was using comments like uh, an instant messenger. It was really funny. It was great. It was awesome. But, uh, anyway. Well, uh, I'm sure I'm about out of time now. I think I got like another minute left, so I don't really know what else is going on. I'll try to post some songs, man, but if MySpace don't let me, people's MySpace don't let me. And I gotta go home tonight, and I gotta call the police again, because they have to come back out to my house, and so I, I gotta write a police. I made a report earlier, but I couldn't stick around the house long enough, so they took some information over the phone, but I have to call again when I get home. I have the police come out and take a report. I don't know why they can't do it over the phone, but that's the way it works. That's their rules, not mine. Uh, yeah. We've been slow at work lately. I don't know what's up. So, uh, yeah, I don't know. You know, I just hope everybody's cool. Uh, hope everybody's having a great week. Uh, I'm so excited. My friend got engaged. Man, I'm so happy for Josie. Yeah, she got engaged. That's awesome. I'm so, so happy for her. So, uh, yeah. I don't know. Hey, y'all have a good night. Great night. Take it easy. Peace out. Be safe. Do your prayers or whatever else it is you do. But I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.